Every day, people in a certain neighborhood, including those just passing by, notice that stray dogs consistently gathered around the same homeless beggar. Intrigued by the sight, a woman finally asked the beggar why so many stray dogs always surrounded him. His answer left everyone stunned. Dean was a man in his early 40s who had faced many challenges and difficulties before he turned to begging. Before this, Dean was a hard-working man who did his best to make a living. Although he never finished college, Dean followed his passions and started his own business. At first, the business did well, but after some time, something went wrong and he had to close it down. Dean was very passionate about his work and did everything he could to revive his business. And when that didn't work out, his life took a different path and he ended up as a beggar. However, unlike other beggars who often seemed grumpy or had an attitude, Dean was different. He was cheerful, always smiling and waving at people passing by. He always said thank you when someone gave him money and never forgot a face. One reason it seemed like Dean received more money and food than other beggars was because he always remembered those who had helped him before. Whenever Dean saw someone who had given him money in the past, whether it was a neighbor or a regular passerby, he would always thank him again for their previous kindness. Dean always showed gratitude and never acted as if he was owed anything. In addition to being known for his gratitude, Dean was also recognized as the beggar who was always surrounded by dogs, especially stray dogs. It started with just one dog. This particular dog stayed close to Dean, and sometimes people could see Dean holding the dog in a blanket, just like a child, while he asked for money. At first, when people saw Dean with a the dog, they assumed the dog had been his companion for many years, thinking that, like a loyal friend, the dog had stuck with Dean through thick and thin. But that wasn't the case. Dean had never met the dog until he started begging on the street. It all began on Dean's very first day of begging. While he was having lunch, he noticed a stray dog searching for food nearby. Feeling pity for the hungry dog, Dean started to share his meal, trying not to frighten the animal away. At first, the dog whom Dean later named Scott was hesitant and unsure if he could trust Dean. But after several days of Dean feeding him, Scott began to trust him and they formed a strong bond. From the day their friendship started, Scott made sure to visit Dean every day. Dean didn't just share his food with Scott, he also gave him lots of love and played with him regularly. Often people could see Dean cuddling Scott in a blanket like a baby, which is how many in the neighborhood came to recognize him. A few months after they became friends, Dean began to realize that even as a beggar, he could still find a way to be useful. Though he didn't have the money to help other people, he believed he could still do something for animals in need. During the months Dean spent begging on that particular street, he noticed a new stray dog would appear almost every week looking for food. So Dean decided to start caring for these stray dogs in his own small way. One by one, Dean began to attract stray dogs to himself determined to care for them. He would share his small portion of food with them, and if he had no food left, he would use the little money he made from begging to buy some for the dogs. At first, besides Scott, Dean took care of three other stray dogs, and he loved each of them equally. He didn't favor any dog over the others or give more food to the larger ones. He showed the same love and care to all of them. The dogs in turn loved Dean just as much. Often they would sit or sleep beside him during the day while he begged for money. When Dean had four dogs under his care, he thought that would be the limit due to his limited resources. However, his deep compassion for stray dogs wouldn't allow him to stop, so he continued to take in more. Eventually, word seemed to spread among the stray dogs in the neighborhood that Dean was kind and welcoming, and more of them began to seek him out in growing numbers. Within less than a year of staying on that street, Dean found himself caring for more than 15 dogs. Every day, these dogs would visit him as a way to show their love and support for the man who had become their caretaker. Sometimes, the dogs would come at different times throughout the day, while others, they would all gather around him at once, wagging their tails eagerly for his attention. Dean didn't just want to help the stray dogs. He genuinely enjoyed their companionship and never felt lonely with them around. Although he had to divide his food into small portions to make sure every dog got something to eat, he was happy to be a figure they could always rely on. He made a promise to himself that he would do everything in his power to care for them and never abandon them, no matter how difficult things got. While Dean innocently played with and fed the stray dogs each time they visited, he had no idea that people were beginning to notice the increasing number of dogs gathering around him daily. Curious and puzzled, passerbys couldn't help but turn their heads for a second look whenever they saw the group of dogs surrounding Dean. 
One day, as Dean was feeding and playing with the dogs like he always did, a woman in her late 20s approached him. When Dean noticed her walking towards him, he assumed she was coming to give him some money. But instead, she had questions. The woman had been one of many who had noticed Dean's unique bond with the stray dogs and was curious to find out why so many of them flocked to him every day. Surprised by the woman's question, Dean shared his story with her. He talked about his past, his deep love for animals, and his desire to make a difference, even as a homeless beggar. The woman was shocked by Dean's story and asked if she could share it on social media. As it happened, she was a social media influencer, and when Dave agreed, she posted his story online. Within days, the story went viral, touching the hearts of people everywhere. As for Dean's past, he had always been passionate about animals, even as a child. Before he became a beggar, he had owned and run an animal shelter. Initially, the shelter was thriving, but when the government cut off its funding and donations from volunteers weren't enough, Dean was forced to shut it down. Although some of the animals were lucky enough to find new homes, the limited space meant that he had to make the heartbreaking decision to euthanize some of the others. When Dean had to close his animal shelter, he blamed himself for the failure and felt he had betrayed the helpless animals who had looked up to him as a father figure. And this overwhelming sense of guilt led him into a deep depression and caused him to turn to alcohol. Eventually, his life spiraled down and he ended up on the street begging for money. Despite his dire circumstances, Dean continued to care for the stray dogs with the same dedication he had always shown. People around the world noticed his unwavering compassion and began to send financial donations to help him. The outpouring of support was so immense that Dean could hardly believe it was real. With the help of generous strangers and the financial aid he received, Dean was able to leave his life on the street. He started anew and returned to his true passion, helping animals in need. Today, Dean continues to dedicate himself to helping as many animals as he can. He feeds stray dogs every day and takes in as many possible into his home. His entire house, garden, and even his car are filled with dogs in need. Dean's commitment is truly inspiring. Despite his homelessness and financial struggles, he has never allowed these circumstances to diminish his deep love for animals. While many people in similar situations might have focused solely on their own needs, Dean chose to persist in caring for the animals. He didn't let his difficult environment, lack of money, or the limited food he earned from begging prevent him from continuing his compassionate work. Dean's story demonstrates that life's challenges cannot destroy our passions or change who we are inside, unless we allow them to. Thank you for watching this story, and if you enjoyed it and made it to the end, we'd love to hear your thoughts, and please leave a comment below. Also, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel so you can stay updated with all our latest stories. We appreciate your support and look forward to sharing more with you.